On our Winter Florida trip, our fourth stop was at the Army Corps of Engineers campground called Midway on Route 41 in the middle of the Everglades in the Big Cypress National Preserve near Ochopee, Florida. This campground was very well maintained and we enjoyed it. Check it out. We're Dave and Karen from Watts on Wheels and we sold our sticks and bricks to RV full time now that we are retired. We travel with our heavy duty truck Leroy, our two k motorcycles, our DRV Dixie and our smart car Zippy. Don't forget to subscribe and click on that bell to be notified when we post a new video. As you can see, there isn't much of anything out here and there are three Army Corps campgrounds on Route 41 between Naples and Miami. Burns Lake, Monument Lake, and Midway. We have stayed at all three. This is a great route to take if you're working your way across Florida to go to the Keys. Burns Lake is strictly boondocking with vault toilets. Monument Lake is also boondocking, but they do have restrooms with showers. Midway has an electric and water hookup and a dump station. I believe if you stay at Burns Lake or Monument Lake, you can use a dump station at Midway. So let's go in. In 500 feet, arrive at 52870 Tamiami Trail East on the right. Check in here. Hey, Wait hey. for Andrew to camp post to check. Hi. Yep. How are you? Good. How are you? Good. So welcome. Yeah, here's information that they want all the campers to have about living or uh, camping with wildlife. Yep. Um, have you been here before? Uh, not staying. We just drove through here. Okay. I want to go over a couple of uh, orientation things. Sure. Uh, it's based on a horseshoe, so then you, they're all numbered. Here's the flush toilets, the dump station there, hot water's over there. We're in International Dark Sky Park, so at nighttime when you retire, if you could turn out your outside lights, that'd be appreciated. Uh, check out Time is 12 Noon. I'm here at number one, I'll be your host. You're good to go. Okay. Have a good time. Thank you. It must be super windy tomorrow. Okay. So if you put out any lawn chairs or something like that, you might want to bring them in. Okay. Okay. Sounds good. Bye. Thanks a lot, Sharon. All right. Midway Campground is a beautiful place where visitors can enjoy the surrounding preserve while sitting at their picnic table or enjoying the nearby activities such as fishing, hiking through the preserve, and exploring the many boardwalks. This campground offers electric and water hookups for RV sites, a dump station, flush toilets, and water. Each RV campsite has its own picnic table and hibachi-style grill. The RV campsites surround a small lake offering a view from every site. The outer perimeter of the campground is lined with trees. Midway Campground is centrally located in Big Cypress National Preserve, offering a multitude of recreational activities, ranging from hiking, biking, fishing, hunting, photography, and off-road vehicle trails. Located just off the highway, the campground is close to the Oasis Visitor Center, Mikasuki Cultural Center, Shark Valley, and Clyde Butcher's Art Gallery. Things you need to know are wildlife frequency area, so food should be stored in closed containers and put away after use. Dogs must remain on a leash. There is no swimming in the lake. Off-road vehicles are not allowed to operate in the campground. And don't move the firewood. Payments must be made online and advanced reservations at recreation.gov are highly recommended where you can choose the site you want. There is limited to no cell phones coverage at the campground. Quiet hours are from 10 p.m. to 6 a.m. You may stay up to 10 nights during a visit at this campground. Tighten it up and come back. Now you're calling. Great. Good, 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 good. Keep coming. Straight back. Keep coming. Keep coming. Five, four, three, two. Okay, stop. You are going the wrong way down the street. Am I okay right here? That's good. Site 14 at Midway Campground in Ochopee, Florida, Army Corps of Engineer Campground. And the weather has not been very great. 
so I'm just gonna do this from here. We didn't even take Zippy down because uh, we're only staying here three days. It's just a big circle with a big pond with alligators. Looks like they got some trails back here. No hunting, shooting, or dressing game, but it's a little mucky. I'm not going back there. We failed to fill our tanks with water before we got here. My fault. I forgot to look at my notes. And so Dave is down there getting the potable water in a bladder and some jugs for the next three nights. And this is just a one-way big circle, so he'll just be circling around and coming back. sights are a little bit tight because they are at a 90 degree angle to the road but they told it was okay to drive on the grass and to park on the grass said you couldn't destroy this stuff because it you can't kill the grass you gotta take several stabs at it just the way it is eh, one more time there you go Everybody has to drive into the grass to back in to their sights because they're at a 90 degree and rumor has that they're going to tear all this up and put them on 45s. All driver side back ends too. If they do it that way, instead of a blind, yeah. We had uh, Leroy over here but we went and parked him up by the bathhouse because a lot of rain was coming in. and. We just didn't want him to sink. Although they said he'd probably be okay, we just felt more comfortable moving him. But it's a pretty campground. It's right across from the dump station. And you get your dump station and potable water here, just as you leave. When you come in from the road there, you got two hosts on the right hand side. They take turns in different days. Just past them is the dumpster. And if you need extra parking, you can park up here by the dumpster. And this is one through 13 on this side. And we were over in this back corner, number 14 through 27, I think it is. As you come in, you'll see a board up here with some information things you can do here, the campground map, some regulations, and some information about wildlife. Because there are alligators in the pond. And here's the bathrooms. And here they just have the uh, handicapped toilet, nice and clean, and a regular toilet and a couple sinks. No showers. There's Dave finishing off his dump. And there's two 
spots to park to the left of the bathhouse. Dave parked the truck over here when it was raining really hard. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, please give us a thumbs up. We'd love to hear from you in the comments below, even if it's just to say hi. Don't forget to subscribe.